Hi YouTube, Budget Benina coming at you from my channel. Hope everyone is having a wonderful day today and we all survived that hot weather we had last week. Oh my goodness, it was intense. So today we are going to go to Dollar General. Let's go in and see what kind of deals we can find in there that will fit into our budget for prepping. So let's get going. Okay, so we still can get their pasta for a dollar. Um, and this is on clearance, but the pasta is still a fairly reasonable price. They are pretty bare though, what they have. Prego sauce is at a pretty decent price. You can get that pretty decent. And the ragu for $2.50. Um, the hunts has gone up, so that one you can still get, I think. Well, I'll check that one out tomorrow at Walmart cheaper. And they do have some smaller of the Alfredo sauces. Here you look down on the bottom shelf, they got some tomato sauce for a dollar. And those are three for two. Yams, beans, more tomato sauce, diced tomatoes. And that's the Del Monte brand. And there's some with the green chiles in it. Actually, that's a good price in comparison to the Rotel. 5 cents for the tomato paste, 85 cents for the pear for you. The beans, pork and beans, still get those little cans for a dollar. Carrots, corn, peas, chili beans, black beans. for a dollar. Asparagus, that's actually kind of high. Um, sauerkraut's for a dollar. If you like sauerkraut, me, I have never been a fan of it. I tried it, but I don't like it. And I think if I was hungry, I'd probably eat tree bark instead of asparagus. Just saying. You still can get the little five packs of the ramens for a dollar and the chicken and the beef. So stocking up on those would not be such a bad thing to do if you like them or even just to have them for barter items. They do have the soups, but theirs are a dollar and 35 cents for the Campbell's chicken noodle, 25% bigger. Those are still at the five quarter store for five quarters. Just letting you know that. But they do have their brand of soup that is you know, less than a dollar. And some empty spots too. Quite a bit of empty spots for the soups. They do have their beef broth a little cheaper. Oops, sorry, wrong one. Uh. Uh, these are $1.35. All the chow mains that they have. They still do have quite a bit of spices that you can get for a dollar. So, like I said, you can make the best dish, but if you don't have spices or seasoning, it's not going to taste very good. Salad dressings, ketchup, mustard, and barbecue sauces. They do have those still for a dollar. They do have five pounds of rice for three dollars. One thing, the milk is a lot higher priced. And it's pretty scarce too. Shelf 
cows are pretty barren for the milk. these things are a deal but if you can't get it anywhere else at least you do know you can get some meats in their freezer section soft actually remember when that used to be five dollars for six rolls and they've got the quilted northern 775 on that one sparkle paper towels but I don't see a price on that one here's some of the coffee and sweeteners and creamers that they have kind of pan this real quick so you can see the prices on that. It is a little on the pricier side. All right, well, that was the video of Dollar General. Um, hope you guys see some things in there that it might be something you'd want in your pantry. Um, I did see a lot of things that were a dollar and I tried to film all of those. There is still a lot of things that are going up pretty much. As you could see, the coffee was increased. And um, like I was telling you about the Angel Soft, I used to get that for $5. Now it's you know almost $6 for it. Uh, another thing I did want to let you know is, I don't know if you're aware of this, some of you might know, some of you might not, that on Saturdays, they have $5 off a $25 purchase. So you can go in there and buy your groceries up to $25 you know maybe just a few cents over what I usually do is I would pick up another chapstick which was a dollar so it made it $26 that I was spending and they took five dollars off your purchase so basically you are getting five dollars of groceries or at the time when I did it it was a whole package of toilet paper for free can't do that anymore with the toilet paper but um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video I would appreciate a click of that thumbs up and to subscribe and I appreciate everyone who has subscribed and watched my videos. So until the next one, have a great day. Bye.